Hey everyone, this is Marcus Walter back with another video. All right, well, good day to you. It's a Saturday here in the Rockford area in April, and I'm so happy that we're starting to feel warmer weather. I mean, it's winter. We didn't get a whole lot of snow, but it was just enough to uh, make it a little tough at times. So it is nice to know that warmer weather is very soon on its way here to northern parts of Illinois and much of the Midwest. But I'm recording this video because I wanted to mark the third month of me anchoring here in Rockford. If you saw some of my earlier videos, uh, you know that I started anchoring at the beginning of January. And it's been fun. I mean, it's been a learning curve for sure, learning how to anchor, uh, working on my writing skills for the scripts that we use for any given broadcast, working with uh, new colleagues that maybe I'm not used to working with, in, at least in this capacity, as a news anchor instead of working as a meteorologist. But it's been fun so far. It's still been a learning experience as well. And I'm still pretty happy in the position. Now also, if you see, has some rubber bands in my mouth I have Invisalign I'm still going through my Invisalign treatment and one of the nice things about Invisalign is that you can take them out if you need to work or present on camera so that's pretty much what I do typically when I'm anchoring the news I'm not wearing my Invisalign but the minute that the newscast is up or the minute that my day is over I definitely put my Invisalign back in but one of the things that stood out to me over the last couple of months is a comment some feedback I got back from a viewer uh, now this happened back in March. I happened to be anchoring that morning, came across a part of a script in the teleprompter that wasn't that easy to read. So I struggled with it just a little bit until I got comfortable enough with it about five seconds after encountering it. But either way, it was a rough moment as I was going through the broadcast. So when I got back to my desk after the broadcast, I saw that I had a voicemail on my phone. Well, that voicemail, when I took a listen to it, it was from a viewer who said, basically, you suck, <laughs> you're horrible, <laughs> which you kind of chuckle at, you know, people actually take the time to say those things. And he said it so passionately, whew, <laughs> yeah, that did kind of hit me. So it let me know that, okay, this literally bothered him. Whatever happened today or whatever happened over the past couple of weeks uh, really got on his nerve. Most of my career has been working as a broadcast meteorologist. I haven't gotten too many complaints in terms of my on-air presentation. And if I did, it was much earlier in my career, not so much later in my career. So to get this call, it was a reminder that, yeah, people are watching. And some people may not necessarily like when things go wrong. Uh, but I would say to any anchors, any reporters out there, any meteorologists who are working in front of the camera or doing any type of social media work, just know that you'll likely run into a couple of stumbles here or there, but you're not a total reflection of those setbacks, of those stumbles. So just keep working to get better and better every day. And that's what I've been trying to do every day working in this position. So I'm looking forward to continuing to work in this position and continuing to enjoy my time here in Rockford. And with that, I say thanks for watching, and until the next video, enjoy your weekend, and uh, yeah, eat some really good food for me. I'm looking for some good restaurants here in Rockford, and so far I've been good. I found some, but I'm looking for more too, so definitely enjoy a good meal for me. All right, bye. <laughs>